Do you want to create amazing voxel models and pictures, but you don't really know where to start? You're in the right place. To start creating amazing voxel stuff, what you need first is a software that allows you to create amazing models and render pictures. In this case, we are using Magica Voxel. It's a free, lightweight and extremely powerful software. The creator is also here on YouTube and Twitter. And at this page, the link in the description, you can download the software. Be sure to download the right version for your system and at the current state, some of them have slightly different features. But for this and future tutorials, I will explain stuff that is kind of generic and I will not go in full detail of every single option. But what I will explain will allow you to explore this fantastic program by yourself and having fun. This program is updated every few months and from time to time some options change, but don't worry, it's extremely easy to learn. So the first thing you want to do in general is open a new model or scene. The starting model is a cube of 40 voxels by 40 voxels by 40 voxels. And here I will teach you the first basic command of Magica Voxel for deleting or erasing voxels. We start by left clicking on erase, then this part up here is the brush section. The brush allows us to change the shape we use to select or interact with the scene. I will explain all the different brushes later, but for now we will start using this B here. This B stands for box, as this brush allows us to interact with the scene with a box. Now we want to watch the cube from another angle. We have to right click with the mouse on the scene and move around. And we will be able to change the angle of our scene as we want. In the newest versions, there is this little cube in the corner of our scene that allows us to left click and change the angle according to where we clicked on the small cube. Now with the right brush and erase selected, we can erase the cube with a left click on the angle of the cube and dragging the mouse to the opposite angle. Now we should have a clean scene. We just said to the program to erase everything inside the box we were drawing. Now it's time to add voxels. In this case, we select attach and we can left click on the scene and drag. Now we have a shape, maybe just a square, but for now it's fine. The last thing I want to show in this tutorial is painting. One of the core features of Magica Voxel is to modify the color of different voxels. You can do it with a click on paint and then choosing the color on the palette. We will see all the features of the palette in another video, but for now you can change the color by clicking on another color in the palette number 0, or clicking somewhere and modifying the color below. What I showed to you in this video is the core of Magica Voxel. And with the things I explained to you, you will be able to create amazing stuff. Thank you for being here, and don't miss the next video. Bye bye.